in Fox Carolina, the Midday News. And welcome back to the Midday News on Fox Carolina. While spring break is underway for the upstate, many families are already looking ahead to summer activities for their children. Girls on the Run is hosting a camp this summer in partnership with the Greenville Liberty women's soccer team. The campers will learn life skills, develop self-confidence, and create lifelong friendships. I know camp is always a fun thing for me. So joining me today is Naya. She's a player. We have Trinity with Girls on the Run. And then Julie is here on the end. She is a coach for Liberty. So uh, let's start with you, Naya. Okay. What what can girls expect if they go to this camp? And you'll be there too, right? Yeah, we'll be here. It will be so fun. Um, the girls can expect just a great time with the players. We'll get to interact and communicate with the girls and show them a few skills and get them ready for their season. All right. And then we'll pro people are probably wondering, um, if they don't know, what is Girls on the Run? So Trinity, yeah. explain that to people and why you decided to partner with Liberty. Yeah, so Girls on the Run is a youth development program for girls third through eighth grade. Um, and basically what we do is we teach life skills like um, how to make friends, uh, managing your emotions, and resolving conflict, things like that. Mm. Um, and then there is a physical aspect. So during the normal season, um, the girls get mentally and physically ready for a 5K at the end, uh, which we're getting ready to celebrate coming up uh, on uh, April 27th at USC Upstate. So we're super excited about that. Um, so yeah. And how long has Girls on the Run been here in the upstate? Yeah, so we actually just celebrated our 15th year anniversary um, here in the upstate. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. And why did you want to partner with Liberty? Yeah, so I think um, the biggest, uh, Greenville Liberty and Triumph has been a huge supporter of Girls on the Run. So last year when we um, decided to um, do camp, uh, they were came to mind because um, we thought it would be great not only for the girls in the community but also for the players to act as mentors and to build confidence. All right, and this question's for the coach. What activities can the kids expect if they're coming into this camp? So usually, based on the numbers of kids, we divide them into groups and they're given names like strength or confidence. Uh, so they have their own little team groups that they oh, train cool. in and then we work with them in skill stations. Uh, and then we allow them to play and compete with each other. And so the Liberty players and myself, we oversee that portion of that morning of the camp mm -hmm. for Girls on the Run. Uh, and so, as you can see in the picture <laughs> from last year, um, they get obviously that one-on-one -on -one attention and then small group training, which is really where the skill set starts to develop and where they can learn about the Liberty players and what the Liberty players do and, and create more of a personal relationship with them. Um, but at the same time, really develop their skills and their self-confidence. Yeah, that's awesome. And as a coach yourself, I'm sure you're constantly looking for who the next talent is, but also you have to help the girls develop their own um, attitudes and self-confidence. So what's it like as a coach to be able to work with girls at such a young age? Sure. Well, I think that's a crucial age, right? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of evolving. There's a lot of maturation going on. There's, you know, physical changes going on. There's different interests going on. And soccer is a sport that anybody can play, whether you've never played it before or you have a high level of playing experience. And it creates an identity. And I think a lot of young women in that age group are really trying to decide what their pathway is and what their identity is. And I think our players with Liberty have created a pathway through sport uh, created self-belief and confidence through playing the sport at a high level and it's given them a sense of identity and purpose and I think we want to give that back to the youth uh, to allow them to grow and, and youth soccer is just a platform mm -hmm. uh, for that growth. And what ages is the camp for? So it's age, uh, it's third through fifth grade. Okay. Um, yeah, so that's I think 12 through actually it's about probably 10 through 13. And is it just girls? Yes. Okay. And Naya, I want you to give us a little demonstration okay. of what these girls can learn at this okay. camp. Definitely. All right. <laughs> cool. All right. <laughs> yeah, that, you, you did that like nothing. You know? yeah, <laughs> <good job. laughs> well, thank you ladies so much for joining us today. And if you are interested in this camp, it's happening June 3rd through June 7th. It's happening at the Pavilion Rec Complex Center in Taylors. And for more information to register, we have a link on our website at foxcarolina.com. And if you're wanting to kick a soccer ball around today, first alert meteorologist Chrissy